if you want to get maximum mileage out of your vehicle you're going to want to stay tuned and watch this video find out how to get ludicrous longevity out of your engine that's coming up next now first and foremost you have to change your oil frequently every 3,000 miles or 5,000 kilometers this is essential the blow-by that gets past the rings of soot and fuel mixture contaminates the oil there's nothing you can do the filter media slows this process but it will never stop this contamination the only way is to get that oil out and get fresh oil in now the second thing that i do which is pretty much a secret weapon to getting this longevity is seafoam maybe some of you aren't believers but i have personal experience where i've put it into engines i've put it into pumps and it's cleaned everything out nicely you're gonna get two cans the one that you can just pour into the engine crankcase, half of that one can, and the other half into the gas with a full tank. That'll clean out the fuel injectors. Then you're gonna get a second can. This one has a special straw on it that you can put into the intake. Now you're gonna wanna put this into where the throttle body is. You don't wanna run this through your mass airflow sensor. The kit has full instructions on how to do this and you also clean out the intake. Now there's two systems that are constantly polluting your intake which can cause problems in the valve train. Uh, one of them is the positive crankcase ventilation which allows this positive pressure from the blow-by back into the intake to be reburnt. This ups fuel efficiency but also gets things dirty and your EGR exhaust gas recirculation which cools the cylinders slightly but also robs you of some power this also can contaminate the intake as well so running this through the intake cleans the intake the valves the valve seats this in turn gives you better compression it will even clean out the cylinder walls and the pistons so you want to do this process to keep everything just spotless my third tip is change the spark plugs every 60,000 miles or 100,000 kilometers. For the price of a new set of plugs, it's going to get you more fuel efficiency, a better burn, which in turn will keep your engine cleaner. This contributes to the longevity as well, and it's just going to keep it running a lot smoother for you. My fourth tip to engine longevity, this one is not as necessary as the first three, but get yourself a zinc phosphorus additive. Now the SAE or the Society of Automotive Engineers have been phasing out zinc and phosphorus from engine oils for street use. You can still get them for race use, they're considered off-road, but these two elements are critical to hyper longevity and engine wear. They tend to protect the parts seemingly forever. Now there's a couple great products out there to get this sink back into your oil. I personally prefer ZDDP Plus. I can buy it on Amazon in bulk. Uh, that way I can save a few dollars. There's also one from Rizlone and Lucas Oil Products. I believe uh, Lucas calls it an engine break-in additive, but this is something you're gonna want in your oil to get that superior longevity. The reasoning behind the taking out the zinc, I believe they're saying, uh, it may reduce your catalytic converter life, but let's face it, it's a lot cheaper to change a catalytic converter than it is to replace an engine. And if you can get an extra one or 200,000 miles potentially out of your engine, uh, the cost of a catalytic converter is small at that point. I'll be leaving links to all the products I just spoke about in the description below. If you like this video, please smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. See you guys next time.